un, un café, si tienen café en el lugar de Churros. Y creo que tal vez después de ahí vamos a ir a la, al mercado a comprar frutas y verduras y a visitar a, um, el centro si nos da tiempo y después nos regresamos al apartamento por Uber para que no nos agarre la noche. I hope you guys understood all of that. <laughs> what do you guys think of Juan as a vlogger? <laughs> uh, yeah, like he said, we're heading, we're on a quest to find some churros and then maybe stop by downtown to buy some fruits and veggies. Um, it's about a 37 minute walk from here, but today it's not too hot and it's a Saturday, not a lot of traffic. So we're just gonna take a walk there and maybe take an Uber back. And did you say anything else? Uh, basically I said we might go to the downtown. Oh yeah, so we have some time left over. Maybe uh, I'll show Juan around Plaza Libertad, where there's that big Guadalajara sign, the theater and the cathedral, since he has, still hasn't gone down there yet. So. Juan finally found his churro. Seems like he's he's in heaven right now. <laughs> it's hot too, dude. It's good. Is it too hot. sweet? It's good. We might come back get another one later. <laughs> but I haven't been to this part yet. It's pretty much in my there's like coconut coconut juice. I think I was down there before. We were making our way, finding like different souvenirs. But this must be like the central. See, there's food down there. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff over there. Let's do a circle down that way. super crunchy, a little bit sweet, not too sweet, and we're walking down the square right now, it gave us like five or six, it's pretty good. mission we found in churros and uh, we walked through the Mercado Libertad huge huge market you can find pretty much everything there um, now we're waiting for our uber to get home and just had the spiciest taco ever I was literally sweating it off <laughs> on the walk over here and uh, yeah so Mexico also does have public transportation. It's nice. It's a bus station. So often you get a nice view of the city and there's a really nice sunset going down as we're just coming home. But still industrial district. <laughs> Nothing down there. <laughs>
flavor did you get? Lima. Lima? So it's she like, says it's like a special lemon? She, said, she basically says it's like lemon. Oh. But it gets rid, get rid of our... It's, it's good when you're, when you're thirsty, I guess. Uh, but it smells like lemony though, it's just bitter. Okay. Not bitter. I got a horchata de preso. And it was only 10 pesos. So like if you're thirsty on a hot day, stop by one of these um, ice cream places to pick it up. It's pretty good. It's just like a sports bar. This place is called Wingman. It's right next to the Walmart. 